Hey everyone, today's video is the second part of my updated hair care routine and today's products are all styling products. So these are my favorite styling products. These are tried and true and I recommend all five of these. So the first thing that I do when I get out of the shower is use It's a 10. This is the It's a 10 Miracle Leave-In product and on the back it says that it does 10 different things. I mainly use this as a detangler and also a heat protectant. But it says that it adds shine, detangles, control frizz, all that type of stuff. For me, you know, it doesn't add a lot of shine. It doesn't totally control my frizz. So I like to use it as a detangler and heat protectant. What I do is spray it in mainly from about my ear down through the rest of my hair. And I use a generous amount, you know, I'm spraying it around. And then what I do is go in with my tangle teaser. And while my hair's still wet, I'll start from the bottom and brush it out. If you start from the top and work your way down, you're more likely to pull out your hair. So if you start from the bottom and work up, you'll lose less hair. And I used to use a wide tooth comb. And when I compare the hair that was left on the wide tooth comb after I brushed it through, compared to the tangle teaser, I had less hair in the tangle teaser. So that's why I use this now. I highly recommend this. This is really gentle to your hair and you can get it so it's all the way smooth and then you can start to blow dry it. So the next thing that I do is use two pumps of the Moroccan oil and this contains argan oil. I use two pumps which might sound like a lot but right now my hair is pretty long and I focus it mainly from here down, fo focusing it on the ends. And this absorbs quickly into your hair, adds moisture and just makes my hair feel really smooth and I do this before I blow it dry. Um, if you've got less hair, you probably want to use one pump and if you've got really fine hair, they also make a version, the Moroccan Oil Light, which you may like also. Then what I do is blow dry my hair and I blow dry my hair using a round brush and I have a video on that. If I can find it, I will link it below using a round brush and blow it out. Um, when it's all dry, and especially now that I got the ombre, so um, if you haven't seen my hair in a while, I posted the, a picture on Instagram the other day. This is the blondest my hair has ever been, and I know for you blondes, you're probably laughing because it's not that blonde, but for me, I don't know if the light, if you can see it, but it is blonde for me. I had it done a couple weeks ago and it wasn't, it was really subtle and I just felt like this time I wanted to try something different. So I went back last week and I had her darken the roots and lighten the ends. I did this last year, I think around the same time, the January, February time, and I just liked it to get ready for spring. So um, that is what's new with my hair. Okay, so after I dry it and before I curl it, if I do curl it, I like to use the Rusk Deep Shine Luster. And this is a cream. And this product for me adds so much shine to my hair. So what I do, you don't need a lot of this at all. I really use a pea size amount, rub it in my palms, and just gently work it on the ends of my hair when it's dry. So even though I blow dry my hair with a round brush and I really can pull it and straighten it, and get it shiny, the ends now, especially since I bleached my hair on the ends, it just shows the dryness and um, just a little bit frizzier because the bleach is really damaging to your hair and I can really tell a difference. So after I blow dry it, I use a little bit of this. Then what I'll do is fix my hair, whether it's curling it or just, you know, kind of teasing it up at the crown. And if I feel like I need a little bit more shine, and especially now with the bleach on my hair, I feel like it looks really dry on the ends, what I'll do is go in with the Cebu Sashimi. This is a thermal shine solution. You can use this before you flat iron or before you um, use curling iron or after, either way. And what I just do is spray a light misting and I feel like this instantly adds shine. This is not a heavy product like the Moroccan oil. It's very light and it adds instant shine. So I love this stuff. And then what I will do to finish it off, this will come as no surprise, my favorite hairspray is the Redken Quick Dry 18. I love this stuff because it dries quickly. It doesn't smell too terrible as far as hairsprays go. And it holds my hair in place. 
and I just I haven't found a better hairspray that I like so these are the five products that I am loving in, term, in terms of styling products. I'd love to hear from you what you use to style your hair, what you're loving, so feel free to comment below and we can keep that conversation going. And thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you later. Thanks.